Okay, let us understand what is the bomb status. So the bomb status control the bomb processing in a different bomb application area. Okay, when you are configure the system in customization under bill of material, it's defined. Bomb status are defined. Uh, the status of different indicator allowed for bomb processing. Okay, bomb status one can be exploded in MRP release or for plan order. Bomb B, a bomb with a status two cannot be exploded in MRP or selected for plan order. So what is the bomb status? Okay, so let us understand this OS twenty three three four. Okay, slash and OS twenty three. Okay, so uh, where is the bomb status? First of all, maintain. So if you go to your material, bill of material, okay, let me slash n mm sir, cs02. Okay. Now we have created a bomb already. Okay. For this. Okay. Now in this bomb, if you go to this header, so this is a header data. Header data means this is your header material, finished good assembly, or finished good material is called as header assembly or header material. And these are the called as a component data. So if you click on this button, so you select this material, and if you go to this option. This will go for item details. Now we have to go for header level details. So this cap is a header data. So we'll go to header data so we can have a material related details over here. So here we are having one option is the bomb status. Okay. Here is the option of bomb status. Now what is the bomb status stands for? Here we can define the status of bomb, whether this bomb is active, inactive, or it is in created phase, or it is in a release phase, or it is only released for costing or it is released for everything, or it is absolute. Whatever different things which is required by your customer. Again, bomb usage is for application perspective, and this is for your, this is from your perspective of your, uh, what do you say, uh, application, okay, or status, active, inactive, or something like that, okay. So these are the different status of your bomb, okay. Clear team? So here you can select 001, it is active, 002 inactive. Suppose if you say my bomb status is inactive, okay, 02. It means that it cannot be used for MRP explosion purpose. It cannot be used in plan order. It cannot be used in costing. It cannot be used in work scheduling or any kind of functionality. Wherever bomb is going to be used, it is not going to be applicable. You can see nothing is check is activated. Means this is inactive bomb. You cannot use it for any of the application. Okay, this is the meaning of that. Are we clear? But if you say it is an active bomb, then you can use for all the functionality. Now here you are saying it is a costing bomb. So only it is used for costing purpose. If status is 12, so same bomb only get locked only for costing activity. In CK11 only we can use it. We cannot use it for production purpose. Are we clear? Team? It controls the usage of bomb, sir. Yeah, it is control application Inter or usage of bomb. Whether for use for MRP running, you have to use for plan order to production order conversion, you have to use for costing or work scheduling or for releasing the order or collective order or sales order or whatever it may be. So according to that, as per your status of bomb, you can control the bomb. Sometimes you have to make the bomb as absolute. So can you use the absolute? The absolute and inactive both are same almost. Can you see? Everything is blank on both of the cases. So bomb status is going to it is defined status of different indicators that allowed or disallowed bomb processing. Means while MRP you want to process the, this bomb, if you have tick mark, okay, if you have made a tick mark over here, if you have tick mark for MRP, then it will use for MRP. If it is plan ordered, okay, you can select only release for MRP, okay, some indicator you have created. So what happened? You will have only discretion. Let me go to OS 20 and show you the okay, how it's work. But uh, uh, Umesh, Umesh uh -huh. so what is the difference between the bomb types and the bomb status? Because it is the same functionality it is in our bomb types. No, 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 no. It is more in details. I can try to understand. There was option production bomb, sales bomb, maintenance bomb. Okay. See. Because the same options are already there. No, no, no. These are the different. Don't get confused. Okay. So in bomb usage, Okay, let me go to slash forest. Okay, see here usage is what? Are you going to use for production purpose? Engineering purpose. See the screen. The screen is totally different. Mm -hmm. And here, this application is inside that production 
are you going to use for okay. manufacturing planning and something uh -huh. purpose okay so both screen are different okay. the application is totally different okay okay, okay. Chal. Mm.